Hello internet friends. Welcome back to my channel. Thank you for joining me today. Today's going to be a little bit of a different video. Um, as you could probably tell, you could probably hear it. Um, I'm still not feeling well. My throat hurts and um, I'm losing my voice a little bit. So what better thing to do when you're not feeling well and your voice is gone than to sit down and film a video. Um, yeah, I'm smart like that. So today um, we're going to be discuss just talking about the channel. Um, we're not unboxing anything. We're not doing any product reviews. We're not, we're not doing anything. We're just going to talk if that's okay with you. Um, I don't feel great. I have my coffee um, and we're just going to drink some coffee and we're going to talk. Okay. So welcome to this exciting time. Um, thank you for being here. Anyway, so the first thing, of course, I want to talk about is um, the fact that I don't feel good. I'm, I've got, I don't want to say a cold. Some people might call it allergies. Maybe it's allergies. It feels very much like a cold. Um, I'm filming this on Tuesday. Yeah, I'm filming this on Tuesday. Um, I have to try to get my shit together to go to work tonight in just a little bit. Um, I don't know how that's going to work. I don't know if I'm going to be able to do it, but I'm going to try. I'm going to try. Anyway, um, I'm hoping that I will be feeling much better soon. And um, we can get back into like the regular swing of things. But that is why I've been kind of late on a lot of things. Anyway. The next thing I want to talk about is this. The background. The setting. So um, I know most if not all of you. Maybe not all of you know that my husband has a pretty successful YouTube channel. Um, he was kind of my inspiration for starting mine. Um, the newbie reviews and I'll leave his link, you know, down below. Um, and he's a cutie pie and I love him and he does movie reviews and sometimes product reviews on his channel. And, um, since of course we are married and we live in the same house, um, we pretty much film in the same space and I was kind of trying to make it work for me but it kind of wasn't working for me and he was kind of not loving <coughs> excuse me he was kind of not loving his background as much so we worked really hard this past weekend um, clearing out our filming room our bonus room in our house um and so i have my new background and you can't see it but on this side of the room he has his new background and if you watch his channel you will get to see his new background he has all of his like movie kind of things we now currently have a six foot tall um cardboard standee of darth vader in the corner which i am very thrilled about um so anyway one when i'm feeling a little bit better one day we'll go through my shelf and i will show you like some of my favorite things like my lizzo candle and this tart makeup kit and you know some of the other things my Stephen king book collection down there um but right now we're we're not going to go into every single detail. I just wanted to mention that the, th the background is going to be a little new. The lighting is going to be a little different. Filming setups might be a little different um, for a while until we kind of get it like just right. Um, let's see. I have several ideas and plans for this channel. Um, I have... I want to do a series. I want to do something that would keep me posting on the same day every week. And um, I would like to... Uh, ideally, I would like to post two or three times a week. 
I don't know how realistic that is in my job and my life and different you know, kids and sickness and things like that that happen. But I at least want to have like some some kind of semblance of a schedule. So I'm thinking um, on Fridays doing something called Full Face Fridays where I do a full face of one brand of makeup um, and kind of let you know how it works for me right now um my like makeup routine i say it's a routine but really i kind of change up a lot has i don't know a ton of different brands like i might use one foundation and a different type of concealer and a different type of primer and you know i just you know mix and match high end low end not super high end um unless it's something i've gotten out of a subscription box but Mostly like low to medium, um, medium end. <laughs> I don't know. I'm tired. <laughs> okay. Um, anyway, it's usually just like a mix of products and I'm always curious if, you know, certain brands, they make their products to work together. So would it be better if you use all of one brand like from beginning to end um to create your look would it wear better would they work better together would they you know blend or mesh or lay on top of each other any better so we're gonna try um but i would like to keep it kind of like budget friendly budget beauty beauty on a budget whatever i don't know um so i'm gonna try to do more like lower lower end not in quality necessarily but like in price point so I have some ideas um, I ordered um, not a bunch but some stuff from BH Cosmetics because they're fairly reasonably priced I just got an um, an Ulta order which included some makeup revolution stuff um, and I think I can make that work I just have to pick up a foundation from them um, e.l.f. is another good one. I use a lot of e.l.f. products myself, personally, um, that I love. So, e.l.f. is a good one. Any of the drugstore ones, like CoverGirl, Maybelline, you know, NYX, um, any of those I think would be good. Um, Essence also might be another good one. Um, but I would like to keep it kind of on the lower side. First of all, I'm not fucking made of money, so I can't go out and buy a full face of makeup from a brand where I have to buy everything new or pretty much everything new um, every week or every other week. I probably do this every other week. I don't think I'll do it every week. I can't afford it. Um, but um, yeah, I, so I want to keep it kind of on the low end. Plus, that way you guys get to see if there's anything that really works that is really good quality or really bad quality like don't waste your money on it so you can see when you want to go buy stuff that is you know relatively inexpensive too so anyway that's one plan that I have um, another plan that I have is um, well you guys let me know you let me know down below if this is something you'd be interested in seeing so next week um, next Tuesday, a week from today, I am flying to London, um, and I'm very nervous, very excited. I've never been out of the country before. This is the very first time for me. So the reason I'm going is because my son, um, is in his junior year of college and he is, he has been accepted to the study abroad program. Um, and which he is going to be studying in London. So I'm taking him over there to get him started in school, moved into his dorm, get everything set up. Um, he just needed kind of like a little helping hand for the first few days. So I'm only going to be there for five days. We're flying in on the 10th and I'm leaving on the 16th. Um, so it's not like I'm going to be there that long. and Most of it's going to be spent helping him get situated but I would like to maybe vlog a little bit over there um, record some stuff show you guys what I'm seeing what I'm doing 
Um, I'm sure that there will be shopping involved and I'm sure I will shop for makeup because that is my favorite fucking thing to do anymore is shop for makeup. So I'm very much looking forward to that. If any, are you, any of you guys in the UK, in London, that's, that'd be cool if you could leave me comments about like the stuff that you like or the places you shop, brands, um, I don't know. I would love to know that. Sorry, I'm <clears throat> trying to keep my voice going through this video. Anyway, would you guys even want to see our London adventures? Are you interested in that at all? Because um, I was planning on recording it and then I don't know if I can upload it from there. Probably wait until I get home to upload it. So there may not be any videos next week unless I pre-record this weekend and then release. I don't know how to do that. My husband can show me. He can show me how to schedule. Anyway, I'm sorry. I'm just thinking out loud right now. Maybe I'll do that. So one of the things that another video that I wanted to do is have you guys seen the new ABH palette, the Norvina Pro Pigment Palette, Volume 1. Oh my god. How gorgeous is that? Um, if you haven't seen it, I'll try to put a picture right here. I don't know how to put pictures, but I'm sure my husband's going to show me. So like in this general area, if there is a picture of the palette, please know that I succeeded in getting that up there. If there's not, then just laugh at me because I failed miserably. Um, anyway, the Norvina palette is beautiful. It is, I have not been as excited for a palette in a long ass time. It's gorgeous. It's got tons of colors, but also like you could make some like more neutrals looks if you wanted. Um, you could make really like stuff stunning artful looks um avant-garde looks like festival type looks you could do almost anything with this palette it's so pretty and every single person that i've seen use it talks about the quality is amazing the color the pigmentation everything is amazing the blendability is amazing so i had to pick it up and i know it's 60 dollars, and i know that's expensive and um, more than an eyeshadow palette should be in my, in my personal opinion, but damn, she's pretty. And I had like $17 and something and maybe 18, whatever. I had some Ulta points that I had been saving up and I just use it on that palette because I really, really, really wanted it. And I thought, you know, if I could bring the price point down just a little bit, maybe I wouldn't feel as guilty about buying it. So that should be here on Friday. And I want to try to do like a um, first impressions, first of all, and then try to create like a few different looks. Are you guys interested in even watching me put on makeup? Speaking of, I have like, no makeup on right now. Like I have some mascara. Of, I put on some lip gloss, but I don't know what happened to it. It's probably in my coffee. Um, so I'm sorry that I look like this and that I sound like this. And I probably shouldn't be recording. And I'm sorry, guys, but I miss doing this and I miss interacting with you. And I just wanted to kind of take a moment, have a chat, you know. I mean, I would like to build a sense of community here. So this is kind of, you know what I, it's the point anyway um would you guys want to see me put on makeup and like try different looks with this palette like i could do one look on one eye and one look on the other um i i'm not a makeup artist i don't know what i'm doing like i don't have any training the only thing that i know is stuff that i watch on youtube myself and i just like color and I like to try things so it may end up being a complete disaster and it might be fun just to watch me um make my face look like shit we'll see but I, I would kind of like to do that with you guys and see see what you think um 
If anybody has an Urbina palette already, oh, they're so lucky. I can't wait to get mine. Let me know what you think of it. Let me know if there's any colors um, that you want to see <clears throat> from the palette and that you want to see me use. Um, I'm saying um a lot today. I'm sorry. I'm sorry, you guys. Uh, I will get better. And um, I just thank you guys so much for watching. Um, we, I may only have 15 subscribers. That's fine. Um, I didn't expect to have 15. <laughs> I didn't expect to have two. I thought my husband would subscribe. Well, maybe my best friend. I thought she would subscribe. But I did not um, expect a lot of subscribers. So I'm cool with whatever. But if you are watching this and you are not subscribed and I haven't annoyed the piss out of you already, please subscribe. Come back and you get to see all these new and exciting videos I'm talking about. If any of it interests you, you know, we're going to do it. Um, that's it. That's all I have for today. Uh, I ordered the catnip box for my cat, so that should be coming. Um... Yeah, that's it, guys. I'm sorry. I don't have anything else. I don't have any colorful swatches to show you. I got nothing. Just my pale ass face. Um, and my pretty shelf and my Lizzo candle. I love her. Um, yeah, that's it. So, <clears throat> have a good day. Have a great week. I hope all of you are doing wonderful. Um, let me know how your week is going. Hopefully none of you are sick. I know some of you are working on exams this week, so good luck to you with your exams. I know you're going to do great. You're obviously a very, very bright person. Um, and I will talk to you later. Bye, guys. See you next time. Mwah.